Street, huh? Anthony here, SpecialtyMotorCars.net at Lars Anderson for Cadillac Day this year. 2021, everybody's excited to get out, show their Cadillacs. Uh, I'm going to bring you around for a walk around of some of the cars in the show field. Before I do that, I'm going to show you my 1990 Brome de Elegance. I had a video of this up probably about two years ago, uh, but I've done some modifications and I want your opinion to tell me if you like them or don't like them. Let me show you. Here it is, my 1990. Cadillac Brome de Elegance. This is one of four 90 to 92 Bromes that I have in my own collection. Uh, this is my only one in this color. Actually, all four of them are different colors. I have a white 90 Brome de Elegance. I have a burgundy 90 Brome de Elegance. I have my blue 92. And then I have this 1990. All of them are de Elegance cars. All of them are 5.7 liter cars. Funny story with this car is... Uh, I had this car in my possession essentially once before and a friend of mine bought it and I stayed in touch with him and uh, I was able to get this car back. Uh, I was very happy to get this car back because when I had it and I shipped it down to Florida, it was a heartbreak to let this car go. Uh, but I'm glad to have it back. I did a walk around of this car once before when I got it back and the modification, if you're trying to pick it out, all those beautiful original appliance wire wheels. So this car had these tires on it originally. Those are Royal Seal replica tires made by Diamondback. And I last fall, I had put these wire wheels on with the reproduction caps. Those are the original style appliance wire wheels. And I think they make this car that was already on another level. Just pop even you know, that much more. It's a really unique car. Uh, it's got some custom painted pinstriping down the side, a little bit of bird poop on the fender. The thing that I really like about it is this canvas top. It's not like the shell tops that you see uh, done aftermarket on a shell that's then affixed to the top. This is just same style as the vinyl, uh, essentially just covered in cloth. Stay fast cloth is what they call it. Uh, another fun fact with this car, I actually hate this color. I don't want to say I hate it, but I really don't like beige or browns all that much. But this car, the color with the top, the gold emblems, and now the wire wheels, really set this car off nicely, and I, and I really love it, especially with the top. I'll show you the inside here. Beautiful, the elegance upholstery. Some of the softest leather. I mean, it's just absolutely buttery soft. Beautiful button tough seats. And this one has got a pretty rare option. It's the factory CD player with the door speaker pods. You can see there the in-dash CD cassette combo. But again, beautiful leather seats. I really enjoy driving this car. So I'm gonna bring you around uh, and show you some of the other cars here. Uh, it's a full show. And uh, I think you're really gonna enjoy some of the other classic Cadillacs that are here at this show. Uh, There's really a good selection of cars. And it's a beautiful, beautiful day to show off some beautiful Cadillacs. Folks, uh, this is a local Cadillac show that happens every year at the Lars Anderson Auto Museum uh, in Brookline, Massachusetts. Unfortunately, it didn't happen last year due to COVID and it was in question whether it was gonna get canceled this year. So unfortunately, attendance isn't the best today. Usually the show field is full of cars, uh, but I'm gonna bring you around, show you some of the cars. I got my car here hiding under the tree. There's Papa Bear in front of it. I'm gonna show you that in a minute as well. A lot of nice mix of cars, some new, some slightly old, 
performance, old, old. And then over there, you can see is a 1931. So good mix of cars. But I come to this show every year and one of the hardest things to do when you have multiple cars or multiple Cadillacs, this year is always a tough one to choose which car to take. Normally I'd like to take my 59 to a show like this, um, but it's 94 degrees. I don't like driving it in the heat. It does have factory air conditioning and it does work, which is great, but old cars, heat, traffic, I don't like doing that. So let me show you around some of the car. So usually during the full shows, all in the center here, double stacked cars, uh, really, uh, I've seen them park cars in the middle of the year. Uh, so unfortunately this year isn't as uh, heavy with the cars, but there is a good, good mix. And it's nice because this show always brings out different cars. There's a lot of cars I've seen before, you know, but this show always seems to bring out some nice stuff that I've never seen before. Cadillac Coupe de Ville. Very nice sedan de Ville. Oh, this is nice. Wow. 1949, 1941 Fleetwood. Look at this thing. Absolutely beautiful. This is incredible. Seven El Dorado. I like those wheels. It's a sharp color. This is a beautiful blue. 67. Yep, 67 Coupe de Ville. Sixty-two, very distinct cars with the fins on these. Yeah, but I mean, I don't know what. How much? Oh, seventy-five Eldorado. It's funny, I actually have one of those. Some people don't know because I haven't used it in forever. I like the hideaway headlights on these. My buddy Jim's Fleetwood. Got a big old sunroof in it. Seventy Fleetwood Brome. That was different. Beautiful in the shade. Oh, 
63, Series 62 convertible. The Alante corner over here. You gotta clean that engine bay. Wow, oh, we're gonna paint on this one. Look at how beautiful. This guy's gotta have no miles on it. Probably one of the nicest Alantes I've ever seen. 93. First and only year with the North Star for these. I'm not crazy about Alante's, but that one's a nice one. 48,000 miles. Cadillac STSV. And it's newer sibling, CTSV. Take a look at some of these. This is an 88 Coupe DeVille. Actually belongs to a friend of mine, George Phillips at Elite Motor Cars. I actually think he'll be selling this car soon. Really a nice car. Beautiful white leather interior. I forget how many miles are on it, but it's it's a real clean car. White car, black canvas top. Got the Continental kit on the back. The grill. You like that style? That's his. Uh, that's his shop. Look him up. This one is slammed on the ground. Oh, that's cool. In and out burger. It's a little sale. Oh, wow, look at this. That Continental kit is way cool. Like those bat wing air cleaners. Big zoo. The man, the myth, the legend himself. He didn't see me. <laughs> he wasn't here today. Eldorado for sale. A little tired. CT6, I don't even know. I feel bad, I don't even know what these newer Cadillacs are. Got my bro, STSV. Sixty-two Coupe de Ville. I followed this guy in. This is nice watching this thing drive down the road. The fins in the back. Ninety to ninety-two Brome. I like it with the velour interior. Show you that thirty-one in just a bit. 76 Sedandeville. No, Fleetwood. I'm sorry. This thing is absolutely gorgeous. What's this? 66? Yeah. Fleetwood Rome. I like the vent windows in the back here. Tail lights on these too. Is this your baby? No. No, not mine. Beautiful car. 1966. Just making YouTube life, you know. 73 Eldorado. One thing I like about these is these hubcaps with the huge Cadillac emblem in them. 
And it's rear wheel drive, not good in the snow. <laughs> I used it all at work. That's why I'm buying it. Good luck, guys. Thank Edie's Eldorado. Thank you. This is a Hessen Eisenhart conversion. You can kind of tell the difference right in here by the ASC cars. The ASC had a thicker, and they were done with the Baritz package, so the stainless went down the side. A thicker snap button. These Hess cars are pretty rare. It wouldn't fit. They don't fit? No, those are rear wheel drive. Oh, okay. Front wheel drive, different bolt pattern. Cadillac DTS. To me, the last of the nice Cadillacs. Some people can argue that with the North Star, but. This is gorgeous. 71 Eldorado. It's funny what color will do to make a car jump. The red with the white top, black interior. Really a sharp car. I've seen this car here a few times, but never disappoints to see it again. You ever you get those cars every now and again. You can keep looking at them over and over and over again. I never get tired. <laughs> 65 Fleetwood. I like those Kelsey Hayes wire wheels. Those look good on here. Look at that beautiful interior. <laughs> Absolutely beautiful. Got the dealer brochure, owner's manual. Such elegance. I like how the dash wraps around. Really, really stylish. <laughs> Gorgeous 60. Coupe de Ville. I love my 59, but the 60 I like because the streamlined fins on the back. And I love this color. Interior. Look at the detail work. Yeah, I remember buying a driving car. Seventy six Coupe de Ville. Actually, three of them lined up here seventy five, seventy six. This is kind of cool. White car, red leather with a blue top. Different. Must have been custom ordered. You know what those are? Let me know in the comments. Some people might not. This is real pretty. Baby blue. Mr. Blue. Another Coupe de Ville. This one's got a factory sunroof, which is kind of rare. White leather interior is real nice in that too. I love the front ends on these 57s. The Dagmars. Sedan de Ville for the family man who needed a Cadillac. Let's go over and take a look at that 31. Look at this thing, huh? Beautiful detail work. 1931. Wow. 
Look at the roof line, huh? Absolutely gorgeous. And right hand drive. Wow. There's a little tool kit. Absolutely beautiful. And that would have been a rumble seat, I think, in the back. Might be trunk, I don't know. But there's an accessory trunk. Period correct plate. This car was trailered in. Absolutely gorgeous. Landau bars. And it's funny you see these on hearses today. <laughs> but that was factory. This guy has been around forever. He's still driving. Rhode Island guy. Beautiful triple black brome. I love the cloth top. Red, looking good. Followed up by another antelope mist. Love the wire wheels on these cars. Holy Moses. <laughs> All right, folks. That'll do it for today. Cadillac Day 2021. It's in the bag. Papa Bear. Got a little bit of sun today. I can feel it. Woo! Oh, yeah, it's a hot one out there today. Nice show, though, right? Beautiful. Beautiful, Beautiful All show. those nice Cadillacs. A lot of nice caddies. Oh, yeah. Appreciate everybody for tuning in. Hit that subscribe button, like button if you haven't already. We'll appreciate it, and we'll talk to you on the next one. Stick with us. What's up, everybody? Anthony here, SpecialtyMotorCars.net, here at the Lars Anderson Auto Museum.